Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge has shown she has the appeal and power to lead the royal family as future queen, a podcaster claimed. Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge has demonstrated she has so much appeal and so much power to be the future queen in recent years. Expert Roberta Fiorita claimed that Kate goes beyond the queen with her appeal and has embraced the role of matriarch in waiting with the many duties she has taken on. Ms. Fiorito noted Kate had been careful and clever to just give enough to the media with her public appearances. The royally obsessed host said, if you look at the royal family, we have the queen, everyone adores the queen. She is a huge figurehead that people around the world look to, but she, Kate, goes beyond the queen, I think Kate holds so much an appeal, so much power. She is kind the matriarchy waiting, I know that we have Camilla, and obviously she is perhaps gonna be queen when Charles comes the throne certainly be the kind of most senior women in the family, in terms of that kind of brand of the royal family. And the whole world, why they are interested. Why they want to keep reading about the royals. I think Kate is completely pivotal to that, there is a huge amount riding on her, but I think she will continue to kind of let that too much to her. She added, we've seen so much of her being very careful, she could have done so much, she could have been like out there all day every day doing all these different engagements, putting her name to all these different things. I think what's clever about her is that she is always very careful and she has always given us just enough. Co-host Rachel Bowie added, the lead up to her birthday, where she hosted the Carol concert where we had the stunning behind the scenes pictures of her and William at the back of the car when they arrived for the James Bond premiere. The James Bond premiere in general, it feels like the Kate has so much riding on her shoulders as far as modernizing the monarchy and making it feel not so stuffy and I feel like she has a lot a lot coming up this year and will see her take on even more task. The result of the five question survey book, what would she do to kind of act on that? She established a foundation, right, an offshoot of the foundation kind of handle those things. We will see more of that. Hopefully, I think and then, the combination that the picture book they released last year, I feel that more big projects she will be taking on. However, Kate may face challenges in this year as she is already shouldering huge responsibilities of the royal family. Author Katie Nichols said, in recent years, we've seen her leadership in the wake of Megxit, throughout which she's kept calm and carried on. I think this, coming, year she'll come into her own even more, especially as it'll be a tough year for the royals. Harry and Meghan's interviews, in 2021, have caused chaos for the royals, and Harry's new memoir, due out, in 2022, Dash will likely reveal even more intimate details about the royal family, and cause further issues. And Andrew's court case will too. Kate will step up and I know the Queen hugely values her support, and will rely on her more than ever. A close friend of the Duchess of Cambridge also claimed that Kate is quietly growing in confidence being married for 10 years in the royal family. They said, she still finds it quite challenging to mix with those sorts of players, the Bidens, because she's a natural introvert. But she's really growing into the role. Public speaking, is not something that she relishes doing, at all. She's not a put yourself out there, extroverted type of person, it's just not who she is. But she knows it's an important way for her to make a positive contribution and there are some times that you need to get out there and speak for things you believe in.